there has been a dramatic twist in U.S. politics in which Robert F. Kennedy Jr., the scion of Democratic Kennedy dynasty, has halted his independent presidential campaign and is backing Donald Trump, the Republican nominee. Kennedy's decision, which he announced during a lengthy and somewhat disjointed statement, comes after what he described as a series of private conversations with Trump, whom he surprisingly found himself aligned with on several key issues. However, Trump has allegedly promised Kennedy a position in his administration. It's with a sense of victory and not defeat that I'm suspending my campaign activities. Not only did we do the impossible by collecting a million signatures, we changed the national political conversation forever. Kennedy's campaign had been a unique and unpredictable force in the 2024 presidential race. As the son of the late Robert F. Kennedy and nephew of President John F. Kennedy, his candidacy drew immediate attention. But it also sparked controversy and division within his own family and the broader Democratic Party. Running as an independent after initially challenging President Joe Biden for the Democratic nomination, Kennedy positioned himself as a voice for disaffected voters from both sides of the political spectrum, drawing support from those who felt alienated by the mainstream parties. However, Kennedy's campaign has been plagued by scandal and controversy. In the past few months, he faced accusations of sexual assault from a former babysitter, bizarrely admitted to staging a hit-and-run incident involving a dead bear cub, and made the startling claim that part of his brain had been eaten by a worm. These incidents, combined with his long-standing promotion of anti-vaccine conspiracy theories and other unorthodox views, led to a steady decline in his popularity. Despite these challenges, Kennedy continued to hold a certain appeal to voters who were dissatisfied with the current political options. His mix of vaccine skepticism, hardline immigration policies, and the Kennedy family name gave him a unique position in the race, making him a potential spoiler for both major parties. However, as his support dwindled and his campaign's financial situation became increasingly dire, Kennedy began to explore other options. In his statement, Kennedy revealed that he had been in discussions with Trump since mid-July, shortly after the Republican nominee survived an assassination attempt. A few weeks later, I met again with President Trump and his family members and close advisors in Florida. In a series of long, intense discussions, I was surprised to discover that we are aligned on many key issues. In those meetings, he suggested that we join forces as a unity party. Kennedy's endorsement of Trump marks a significant shift in the dynamics of the 2024 election. As an independent candidate, he had been seen as a potential threat to both Trump and the Democratic nominee. Vice President Kamala Harris, but more to Donald Trump, whom he now supports. However, after RFK's endorsement, the Republican Party is now an even bigger force, having an independent candidate backing its frontrunner, putting the competition at two, is to one between Democrats and GOP.